in the second part of the series with ice cream structures with just this basic structure we will make pentagrams and hexagrams and you can extend it to make a septagram and this is a stable structure if we drop it down it doesn't break place a pair of sticks in a v form and interlock them as shown now both the v's should be in the same orientation then add another stick to make a five cornered pentagram to interlock the sticks place one beneath and the other on top of the other stick you can see the underside of the structure the angle between the two sticks in one corner would be 36 degrees Once again, take place two pairs of sticks in a V form as shown. Both should be in the same orientation. With the help of two more sticks, make an interlocked hexagram. A hexagram is a six-pointed star. Weave sticks such that they interlock and stay put without any glue. Now with the help of protractor, you can measure one angle and it would be 60 degrees. Finally, we are going to make a square formation. Place four sticks as shown. Place the fifth stick vertically on top of the horizontal sticks. Weave the last stick to interlock all six sticks in a square pattern. This would be a stable structure. It would stand now, similarly make a bigger square with four horizontal and four vertical sticks. The sticks follow the same warp and weft method of cloth weaving. This is what interlocks them and the model does not open. And an offshoot to this amazing activity is to find the number of squares in this 3x3 and 4x4 mesh. And it's astonishing that there are actually 55 and 140 different squares that you can find in this mesh. To see how we can find 55 and 140, please see our next video. Thank you.